The first thing a person files with the court to officially begin a lawsuit is called a complaint. A complaint begins the legal action, notifies other parties they are being sued and what they are being sued for. To file a complaint and begin a lawsuit, you first need to figure out the right court to file in. Civil complaints, disputes over money or property between parties, not crimes, will either be filed in circuit court or county court. Starting January 1, 2023, circuit courts handle cases where the amount at issue is greater than $50,000 and other types of civil cases like probate. County courts handle cases where the amount in dispute is $50,000 or less. With amounts at issue of $8,000 or less, small claims cases offer the advantage of special rules and procedures designed specifically to help citizens proceed without a lawyer. The clerk of the court in your county may be able to provide you with appropriate forms depending on the specific details of your case. Regardless of which court your case will be filed in, there are certain requirements for filing any complaint. The clerk of court will charge you a filing fee in most cases. If you don't think you can afford the filing fee, you can ask the clerk about applying for a fee waiver. Most complaints must check off several things. Your complaint must state the name of the court in which the action is filed and the names of the parties on each side. After that, you will have to allege jurisdiction. In other words, say why your complaint is properly filed in this court. Then, you'll have to state enough facts alleging at least one cause of action, which is the right that a person has to begin a judicial proceeding. For every cause of action, such as breach of contract or negligence, the law defines what elements must be alleged. Each independent cause of action must be pled in a separate count of your complaint. A complaint following one of the forms available online from the courts or the Florida Bar will properly state a cause of action. After your complaint is filed, you will need to effect service of process on the defendant. That's the person you are suing. That usually means having the sheriff's office deliver a copy of the complaint and the summons to the defendant. But check their requirements where you are filing. On the other side, if you have been served with a complaint because you are the defendant in an action, you will need to file a pleading in response. Most often, that pleading is called an answer. Your answer must respond to each allegation by admitting, denying, or stating that you are without knowledge of the allegation. It should also contain any affirmative defenses you may have to the allegations. Some defendants move to dismiss a complaint before filing an answer. If possible, seek the help of a lawyer, but if you represent yourself, be prepared. The Florida Courts Help app and help.flcourts.org are available to provide you with self-help tools and information so you are prepared for court.